Hello? 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 Hot 107.3's Crazy Calls. By the way, do you know what they call me now? I thought you were on a crazy call. One of the people, in fact, the perpetrator of the poo. I know. I'm going to do it. With Crazy Dave Noonan. For Scrubbers Car Wash. Open 24 hours. Now, this is a lovely little story. Donna Lee rescued a cat from being put down. Is that right? Yeah, well, sort of. The, her cousin's friend uh, had a cat that they were going to put down, and it happens to a lot of cats. And she said, no, 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 I'll look after it. Hello? Yeah, well, yeah is that Donna? It is. Yeah, you know, Donna's knocker here. Hey, uh, you know, you've got your, the cat you got from uh, your friend's cousin. Yeah. That's my cat. The the, tur- the one you call him Turtle now. No, I don't know, they call one Turtle. What do you call it? Gizmo. Yeah, we used to call it Turtle. Yeah. We, we want that cat back now. The kids, they they really keen to get it back. So can we get it back now? No. What do you mean, no? Because um, I'm quite attached to him. And I've just spent a lot of money on him. When we give it to you, it was only to look after because we were going through a bit of a rough time. And now we want it back. Well, I wasn't told that. What was you told? I wasn't told that he was... I was giving him back. Well, he was told that you, it was just going to someone who'd look after it for a while until we was ready to have it back. Well, I wasn't told that. What was you told? I was told that um, it was going to be put down. No, we was never going to put him down. Oh, well, you know, the missus had said it once. So she, I'm sure she was only joking. She didn't really mean it. You did. You wasn't really going to put it down, was you? No, of course I wasn't. Bloody hell. No, she says she wasn't going to ever put it down. She doesn't want to let us see the cat, love. What do you reckon? You can't keep our cat! Mrs. isn't happy. Where's Kim? She's not here. Tell her that she's not going to keep our cat! Well, can you get Kim to call me after, please? Well, I will, but so when can we... I mean, the kid's really keen to have it, to get the cat back. Can you get Kim to call me? Hey, give us back our cat! So I'll talk to Kim. Well, what's that, what difference is that going to make? A great deal. Okay, can we come to some arrangement where we can share it so the kids can come around and and get it? You get Kim to ring me, but okay? If if the kids can come around and play with the cat, what do you reckon? Well, I want to talk to Kim, okay? Yeah, all right, but would Look, it be... I'm not going to make a decision until I talk to Kim. All right, well, I, 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 I'll tell you something. I, if, if we can come to some arrangement, then we've got a dog and you you could come around and play with our dog. You know what I mean? Like, I, I, I'm way, not into dogs. What are, what are you into? Because we've got guinea pigs, we've got a no, rabbit. I'm, I'm not into... We've got a goose. No. Because we've got a couple of acres here now. We've got a goose, we've got a duck. That's why we can look after the cat. You're not into any other animals. Because what we could do is we could rotate them animals around so you could have one and then we could have one. But the kids the kids really love that cat. That's the thing. Look, you just get Kim to call me a car. All right, all right, I'll get Kim to call you, but I'm just trying to float an idea with you because then I can go back to the kids and I can say, yeah, we're going to be able to see it, see the cat again. You can't keep our cat! Um, yeah, look, I've got to go. Right, well, you can't go before I tell you that Taylor's caught you on a crazy call. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Your little daughter. <laughs> I'm going to kill her. <laughs> You're going to kill her? Yeah. You're not getting me cat back. Hey? You're not getting me cats back. <laughs> if you want to catch someone on a crazy call, you can either ring Dave on 13 20 or email dave at heart107.com.au.